signed the president's climate commitment, which was a commitment to make sure that we could m push towards sustainability in the very near future. Today, I will be going to a humanities and social sciences conference. We had a combined run with the Air Force ROTC unit, uh, starting over at Pot SUNY Potsdam and ending at uh, back there after making it across the Clarkson's campus and circling uh, part of Clarkson's campus and, um, and then I was ready for an 8 o'clock class so I've learned that ROTC is up and active very early uh, and they're very fit. The Presidential Switch Day is a charity event. Uh, it's actually a raffle. President Collins actually decides it. Uh, this year it's the Make-A-Wish Foundation. What's good for the student is that they get to see what President Collins does on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, but what's really important to us uh, as an organization for the students is that President Collins, he gets to see on an uh, average day what a random student gets to actually do and what their interests are and meet their friends. Well, I'm replacing Anthony Spencer today. Uh, he's an ROTC uh, Army cadet. Uh, and it's clear that he has a grueling schedule. It's a lot more difficult than we think to do even the littlest things on campus. I know that um, us as students, we tend to complain about a lot of things and wonder why they can't be fixed so easily. They seem like such simple problems to be fixed. But then when you realize the administrative side of it, you realize there's a lot of good people working very hard to make progress and it's just a slow process. Are there some changes you are thinking about implementing here? Uh, yes, um, there's not much more I have thought about going over besides normal typical things like expelling homework or something like that. And maybe we could lower the amount of emails we get around here because it's a really, really bombard your email. So I've been trying to work on a few little things because uh, most of the bases have already been covered. Uh, we're going to disagree on homework. Emails, I think most of us these days would like to see how we can contain that information flow. What different way can we communicate? I think th there's a, a good old-fashioned solution to that, and that is just more face-to-face -face communication.